plaintiff, Cynthia Williams, says the defendant is her son, and she claims he's a compulsive liar, a drug user, and a hustler. Cynthia admits she was a drug addict, but says she's been clean for eight years, and she wants her son to do the same. She's suing him today for parking tickets. Defendant Toby Williams says he turned to the streets when he was nine years old because his entire family was addicted to drugs. Toby admits that he got some tickets in Cynthia's name, but insists she got some of them as well. All right, tell me what happened. Uh, Your Honor, Toby is one of seven children of mine. Uh, during his childhood years and teenage years, I was a heroin and cocaine addict. Uh, Toby got addicted to the fast lifestyle because I did a lot of things around him that he liked. He's going down the wrong path. I would like for Toby to change his lifestyle. Your Honor, as of August 11th, I celebrated eight years clean. Good. Uh, yeah. uh, I already have one son that's in penitentiary for uh, drug possession, and I want Toby to change his life. Uh, Toby has what been- What is he doing wrong now? Uh, the same thing. Mm -hmm. You know, he loved the dress, get high, you know, he's very irresponsible, a compulsive liar. You know, he just don't How have does he any, support himself. Uh, hustling. And it I, I don't understand, Toby. You know, he he want to freeload. He think you owe him something. And I don't owe him anything. He lives with you? No, he lives with my mother. He pays no rent. He oh. Just freeload. How old? He's 34 years old. Yana, maybe my life wouldn't be as bad as it is if, you know, if I had a protege when I was coming up, mm -hmm. you know. When I was coming up, I, my whole family was in, getting, getting high. So, right. you know, I had nobody but my friends on the streets, you know. So it was very hard for me, very, very hard. When I was nine years old, I went to the streets. And I started selling candy, snowballs, anything I could, you know, whatever it, whatever I had to do to put, provide for my family. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, when it the comes last time you worked? <laughs> never. I really never, never had a, a real job. All right. Always it wouldn't be did. so rough had you tried that. There Let's you get go. Back there to you, you go. <laughs> right. Go ahead, man. You're not the only one grew up like that. Right, Go right. Ahead. You know, them, them just excuses that he I used, know. you know. At 17, it's it might be a rationale. Right. But at 34, it's an excuse. Defendant Toby Williams is being sued by his mother, who claims Toby is a compulsive liar, a drug user, and a hustler. Go ahead. Uh, Your Honor, I'm here today because uh, Toby been purchasing cars in my name. Um, you know, that's how they do out West, I guess. Uh, that's where the tickets to, come from? He, right. He got uh, $1,900 worth of tickets. Let's see it. Uh, in my name. How did you find out? They sent, uh, they me. sent me a letter stating that uh, I need to uh, pay those tickets. And then Toby called me and told me I need to get on the payment plan to pay them. <laughs> <laughs> What did you say to him? I told him I was already on a payment plan. I don't plan on paying. <laughs> well, Yana, I didn't. I didn't actually tell her to get on a payment plan. I was. I was letting them know that we have tickets. We need to. We need to cut off. Uh, <laughs> Well, I what, I call tickets. <laughs> she called some two. She kept. She called some tickets too. I want. I mean, Your I Honor. made up called two tickets. What do you say, ma'am? This is a paper that I got when I went to suspend the license, and this is a letter from my niece stating that he is a compulsive liar. <laughs> You're not a compulsive liar, are you, Weston? No, I'm, I'm not a I mean, I mean, Judge Yana, everybody may tell a, a lie every okay. now and then, but I'm not a compulsive liar. All right, Your Honor. A compulsive liar would say that. They would I'm, say not, I'm not. I'm not. I'm well, not that's a, what a compulsive, compulsive liar. would say. Right. <laughs> right. Uh, Ma'am, of the two cars, how many have you driven? I have drove one of them. A few times, Which but I one? don't have any tickets. The, uh, Monte Carlo. What time frame? I'm gonna say 2008 through That's now. It. Just no, 
No, just Only in 08? Yeah, in Twice 08. in 08? In 2008. Has she driven it more? I have caught two tickets. That's all I'm <laughs> I, I, Your Honor, I drive the car. Sir, I'm asking you about your mother driving. Okay, okay. Has she driven it more than a couple of times? Yes. Yes, oh, she has. God. Approximately how many times? I'm going to say about maybe five to six times. All oh, right. my God. How long have you had the car? I had the car for about five months, six months. Out of six months, she drove it five days by your admission <laughs> and just coincidentally she accumulated all these tickets no you're in the honor. five days not that she five drove. not five straight days it I might be she, she, five, she might come, she might come over and say can i right. see the car okay and just, cool. out of, just coincidentally out of those six months that she would come over periodically that was the period honor, that she got the tickets yes all right you're on no, i don't believe you i mean her feet very heavy oh wow it's not, very. Not, she Speeding tickets, sir. Yes, no, parking. they have cameras on the light now. So if you run the light, that they flash it. That's not what the That's ticket a, is for, sir. The tickets are for parking. 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 Judgment for the plaintiff. Oh, thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Toby. I love you dearly, mom, but oh. I don't believe you just did all this. I like had this. to. I had to. Well, it is what it is. I still love I you. I love mama. you too. Oh.